thing. They played 52 straight years before the game was canceled last year. So this is the first time JT Daniels has had a chance to go up against the Commodores. JT Daniels, a guy that's already missed a game. We touched on it earlier. Injured his oblique prior to the season even starting, but looked more than healthy. They said he took the reps this week and really no concerns health-wise for the quarterback. He'll throw immediately and quickly to Lade McConkey, the possession receiver, gets the first down and the yards after the catch. Snap. Again, a fake and then a, just a little toss to Brock back. No drop off, but definitely it's hard to get into a rhythm. Fake to McIntosh and a little a tunnel screen catch made by Kyrus Jackson. We'll show you those in just a minute after we show you the first down catch by Jackson who is down inside the 30 yard line to the 27, two straight catches for the D8. Well, we talked about Jackson, hadn't had a ton of looks. He's coming back from that knee injury, he just centers up. Right. Another catch made in the open field. Daniels all day, throws to the, into the side, the 10, to the five, to the goal line, touchdown Bowers. first half and Ethan Barr who was in on that tackle off the field helmet issue Daniels in zone touchdown lad McConkey <laughs> for an opponent that comes in here hot fake to Kenny McIntosh Daniels wants to load up and he's got another open receiver at midfield or more for this Georgia offense. The SEC freshman of the week last week. AD grabs it again, fumbles the football, but 